Women still earn 78 cents for every dollar earned by men, according to research firm Payscale. A successful woman in tech realized it was happening to her, too. New at 10, she developed a plan to triple her salary and is sharing the wealth to help women in all fields close the gender pay gap. I ended up changing my life. Lauren Hassan travels around the country inspiring women to ask for the money they deserve. I tripled my salary. Five years ago, it was the software engineer who needed a little inspiration. It was like a punch in the stomach. When a male colleague complained about his salary openly, Hassan realized she was part of a statistic. 63% of the time, women in tech are offered lower starting salaries than their male counterparts. And mind you, I was managing him and training him, but he had been hired on at 50% more than when I was at his level. It was the push she needed to invest in herself, spending thousands to learn negotiating techniques from the pros, and it paid off. I didn't just triple my salary, but I earned an additional six figures. Wow. That's how Developer was born. She founded the company a year ago to teach other women in tech the secrets to negotiating success. As women, we are conditioned that if we do good work, we'll get noticed and we'll get promoted. And it doesn't work that way. Hassan says start talking about what you bring to the table. And when you do that over time, people hear the message, and what you build is a reputation. She's developed a formula to become a negotiator. First, ground yourself in data. Go figure out what you're worth. Do your research, find that number, and then stand firm in your value. A negotiation is not a yes or no answer. It's a conversation. Don't wing it. Prepare talking points and scripts. If you're asking for the right amount of money, you're going to get pushback. I was literally putting tens of millions of dollars in their pockets and receiving zero credit. Stacy Devineau, an Android developer, got a dream job offer and says thanks to Hassan's course, she turned it down. You rejected the first offer, which was a competitive offer. Which was a very competitive offer, yes. And that was uh, very difficult. <laughs> <laughs> but she negotiated for more. And getting an additional $35,000. A total salary boost of $65,000. These are the kind of statistics Hassan wants women to be. If I can do it, any woman can do it. So those big salaries are tech salaries, but Hassan says women in other fields like catering and government jobs have also been able to negotiate their salaries using some of these tips. There are free resources on her website in addition to a paid course. Some great tips there. I've got to ask you, though, because this can be kind of tricky. How do you talk about yourself positively without bragging? Right. So Hassan says that you can do it in a genuine way, a mm -hmm. statement, something like, I really enjoy connecting with people at the conference. I just finished this big project. And she says the magic is in doing it often and in telling many people. People who influence your career have to know you for what you do. Well, some great tips. Again, I think uh, for both women and men, really. I mean, you know, the, the, it's the, an education. the ability to be as confident as you need to be to stand there and uh, demand what you're worth. And that's the key word, confidence. Yes.